Hello everybody on the internet, this is Major Gamer here and I am a Super Gamer Brother. <laughs> to another episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Now, as you can see, a bit, kind of a lot is different. Oh. In the last episode when I ended off, I, for I forgot to save. Oh I, my God. I guess I didn't play enough in order to save. So what I basically just did is just close the app, like the, the game itself, I just closed it entirely. And I came back and I had to redo the whole um, island picking. So, not a lot has changed. I, the styling name is still Major Gamer. My name is still the same. Um, my clothes are different, and I, I think, for in my opinion, it's kind of better. You know, I got the nice button-down shirt. Our Islanders are also pretty different as well. Um, we have a tiger now. Instead, of, so Cody, my favorite one from last one. Um, he's not here, sadly. It's now we have a tiger, and we also have a monkey. And uh, I'll probably show you guys what they look like in a bit. But for now, Tom Nook wants to talk to us. Ah, oh, there you are. I hope you had a pleasant nap. Or, well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It's a brand new day. I slept that long? Oh, oh yes. It's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip and a major life event. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to life in our little paradise. First, you'll need one of these, yes? <gasps> An iPhone 7! Oh, never mind. It's your very own Nook phone! Oh, thank, thanks, Tom. I had these made especially for island residents. Oh, I want to make sure it's working right, so could you try turning it on for me? Hmm? Alright. Oh. Welcome. Oh, look at all those apps. Good, good. Looks like you're getting... <laughs> looks like you're getting good reception as well. Okay, feel free to put it away now. Say, so, hey, Marcelino, have you ever used a smartphone before? Uh, I'll say sure have. Very good. Then this should be a breeze for you. In fact, these new phones are rather easier to operate than ordinary phones. Oh yes, we simply removed most of the features. Ho oh, ho! I have one more thing for you. It's your itemized bill. Okay. So this includes everything. Airfare, accommodations, labor, tax, and of course your new phone. Hmm? Bringing your grand total to the modest sum of 49,800 bells. Yes, yes, well done. Wait, you don't have any bells. I can't believe I didn't think of this. Ah, of course. Well, no need to worry. I was prepared, I was prepared for exactly this type of tricky situation. With a getaway package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bells. I call this extremely helpful service, the Nook Mileage Program. Nook Mileage? Um, what's that? Well, it's quite extraordinary if I do say so myself. With the Nook Mileage Program, you can earn miles by simply living your life here on Major Gamer. I dare say, the more you enjoy your island life, the more Nook Miles you can earn. And you can use them to pay back more your move-in fees and much more. So the bottom line is, you need 49,800 bells to pay your move-in fees. But with this new service, would you believe it? It only comes to 5,000 miles! I'll just go ahead and register you so you can pay in miles. Yes, yes, but there are more details available within your Nook phone. Just, just open the Nook Miles app. And you'll see that you've earned some miles just for traveling to the island and joining the program. No, if you'll excuse me, I must get back to a few other matters. Let me heartily congratulate you once again on your arrival. I'm so happy to have you as a resident of Major Gamer and a client of Nook Inc.
my new life is underway. I can do whatever I want. Woohoo! From now on, island type will match. From now on, island time will match the flow of time in the real world. Do not touch the power button when you use when you see the autosave indicator in the top right screen corner. Well, now I know. You can also save and quit your game after pressing the minus button. See, I didn't have that option yesterday because I just ended off when I slept. Oh, and our the phone is like. All right, I guess we have something in our phone. Oh, Nook Miles. Sorry. Let's see what let's see what this is all about. Nook Miles, you're enrolled in the Nook Mileage program. Earn Nook Miles for completing island activities. Next. Then trade those miles for various perks and goods at the Nook Stop. Nook Stop in the Resident Services Center. Next. Make the most out of island life. Earn Nook Miles. All right, close. So, Major Gamer Miles, get miles. Uh, claim. Major Gamer Miles, so you travel a long way just to move to our little island. And you enrolled in the Nook Mileage program, so you earned your first miles. There are lots of ways you can earn miles by just enjoying island life. Get miles. All right. Oh, we got 500 Nook Miles? Dang. We got a title. All right, so that's 500 out of 5,000. All right, so we have a lot of stuff we can do, guys. So, wow. Um, so, okay, so before we do anything, let's go check out. I want to show you guys. Okay, so this is one of the new Islanders that was not in the last episode since I had to restart everything. So, um, his name's Rowan. Uh, I don't know. I should probably give him a new voice, not the Cody voice. So, Cody's unreplaceable. Cody's not replaceable's voice. His voice is unreplaceable. So let's give this guy a new voice. Yo, I'm, yo, I'm pumped about that spot you helped me pick out from my tent. Thanks for the push. I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies. Mango. Wait. Oh, is he Hispanic? Oh, he could be Hispanic. All right. I hope we can keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies. Mango. All right, I've got something here for you, Mango. Thanks again for finding a place for my place. Oh yeah, cause uh, Cody, so Cody and him are basically, I guess they're the kind of like, they they're the ones that promised you to like they're gonna give you something. So this is the thing they're gonna give us. That blank cap is perfect for Major Gamer. You can try it by pressing X to open them up your pockets. Then press A to select the item you want. Choose where if you want to put it on. You can always change later if you need to work out, Mango. Alright. Let's try on the hat. Let's see how it goes. Where? Hey! Now we got a hat. Hey, thanks. <laughs> thanks, Rowan. Oh, well, he's a Spanish, so. Ro Rowan? Rowan! This kind of sounds like Juan. Where did you go? There's literally not that many places. Okay, here she is. Here she is. She's collecting tree. Uh, she's collecting branches. So her name is uh, Shadi. Shadi, like a melody in my. Marcelino. Thanks, thanks a ton for earlier. I got my tent all up and running thanks to that pep talk. The brochure said we'd be on an uninhabited island, so I was all ready to go solo. Cheeky. So, I can totally go with having rock stars like you around, though. Let me know if you need anything. Oh, yeah! I was thinking about how to thank you, and I came up with the recipe for a leaf umbrella. <laughs> My voice. Oh, so she gave us a recipe? Alright, so the first thing I thought when I got here was, Now that's a lot of weeds! <laughs> that's kind of where I got the idea! It's a DIY project that uses weeds! Weeds! If you've never done a DIY project before, you should ask Tom Nook to help you out. He's doing free DIY demos over at Resident Services. So excuse my, like, um, voice acting. It's not that great when it comes to females. Uh, so, <laughs> sorry about that. So let's go check out the app. I'm pretty sure... Alright, Island Togetherness. Yeah, we completed that. Bam! We got 300 Nook Miles. Oh my gosh, that's freaking adorable. Alright. So we did that. Pick up the brand, blah, blah. So we, we got some stuff to do. We have we have some stuff to do. We can do the billboard, um, bulletin board thing right in here. Alright, so I hope you all stay safe out there, you know, um, due to the virus. That's <laughs> something like, you know, heartwarming. So I hope you guys stay safe, you know. Something, something just like, you know, heartwarming. June 2nd. Alright, hope you all stay safe. So... There we go. 
So I guess we put something in the bulletin board and that's gonna give us some nook miles. Oh, where's it at, where's it at? Is it gonna be at the top? Hmm. No, it's gonna be at the bottom, right? Yeah, there it is. Nook miles, all right, we got 300 more. Bam, 300, I'm taking your first time photo. Oh, okay. So we can take a photo? All right, we could, let's take a photo somewhere. By the beach, maybe? Oh yeah, by the beach. I'm really feeling this one. So let's take a photo. And I close my eyes. <laughs> okay, and now we gotta edit our passport to get some more Nook Miles. Passport, your passport information is shown here. So this is the photo I took on like the first episode. Well, technically I took it today because I had to restart it, but it would have been this for like, it would have been like this for the first episode. This information may be seen by other players when visiting another island, for example. Next, you can change your photo title or comment at any time, customize them to show off your style. All right, so uh, can I customize <laughs> passport photo comment? 20 minutes later. Nah, all right, let's just keep it like that. All right, there we go. And now we got some more Nook Miles, which is great. Oh, we got a map. Okay, check the map for your current location. You can also press X to change the settings and choose whether to display the mini map during your day-to-day -day activities, all right? So that's where, that's my home, and I'm over there. That's Rowan's home, airport, resident services, and shoddy. <laughs> shoddy, my melody. All right, rescue services. Use the service for an emergency situation on the island when your path is blocked and you're stuck. Uh-oh. You'll be sent to a place such as your home or resident services. Nook miles are generally required to use this service. So we're gonna need nook miles in order to be rescued. Call rescue services? Uh, no. We do not need rescuing right now. So let's go. So we've done the basic stuff that we can do at the moment. But they said, she said that Nook was showing how to do stuff. Uh, let's, we'll check, we'll check out, we'll check whatever that's all about. But I'm pretty sure there's mail that I forgot to check. Oh, Nintendo. All right, dear Marceline, thank you for downloading the update. We'd like to give you a present to show our appreciation. Please remember to keep an eye out for future updates as well. All right, no problem, Nintendo. Let's see what this is. Place in pocket. Oh, but there's another one. All right, dear Marcelina, congratulations on your big <laughs> congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that is sure to come in handy from Nintendo. Aw, thanks, guys. All right. Let's go. Let's see what this they are. Oh, leaf umbrella. All right, present open. Oh, Camilo's. Oh, we got a world map? Ooh, all right, and then let's open the second one. Simple DIY workbench. Ooh, all right, let's see what these are. Maybe we can put them in um, on our, for <laughs> we can place them in our home. World map. Uh, maybe over here? Hang on wall. You can't hang, you can't hang things on tent walls. Really? Oh man! I gotta make a house then. I gotta make. I gotta make a real house. I don't know how to do that yet though. All right, so let's go over to Tom Nook. See what's what's this all about? Um, Cause he's he said something. Uh, Sherry said some. Shoddy said something about um. Tom Nook knowing how to do so. Ah, uh, Marcelino, welcome, welcome. As you can see, it is quite cozy in here. It's funny how cozy doesn't always mean comfortable, hmm. Let me know if you need advice on how to spend your time on this island, or anything else. If you need some advice about basic island materials, you should talk to Timmy. He can help, he can help you procure some of the essentials for thriving in our little paradise. And if you want to earn some battles, he has a rather generous policy of, purchase, of purchasing just about anything. Not strictly advisable from a business perspective, but quite generous, yes, yes. Oh, one more important thing. I'm offering a free DIY workshop that can help you really build out your island experience. I think it would be quite useful, so I do hope you take me up on it. Hmm? Um, I'm, I'm actually gonna take you up on that. Who would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Um, about that workshop. 
This yes, the DIY workshop. Each participant will make and keep their own tools and receive a set of DIY recipes. I think it will be quite useful for item making. So shall I put you down for the next available session? Um, I'd love to, yes. Yes, yes, that's the island spirit. I happen to be free right this very moment, so let's get started. <laughs> I thought I was gonna have to wait a while. Welcome to my DIY workshop. Oh, I suppose workshop is overselling it a bit. Hmm. When you see how simple it is to DIY or do it yourself, you'll do you'll understand what I mean. The basic idea is to gather materials, follow a recipe, and then craft using a workbench like this one. So today we'll be constructing a fishing rod using common materials that you can find anywhere else. In this particular recipe will require a mere five branch, five tree branches. It is admittedly a little flimsy. Now then, come see me once you've collected the materials, hmm? Alright, um, I was gonna ask how to create the other stuff I have in my inventory, but you know, uh, I'll probably maybe do that next episode. <laughs> um, since it's all, I've been playing for a good 26 minutes by now. But alright, let's go and collect five tree branches, he said. Let's get the hee haw out of here and go to Tom. To Tom, to Tom, to Tom, to Tom, to Tom, to Tom, to Yo, Tom, I'm back with the sticks, my brother. Ah, more slowly with all the necessary materials, hmm? Well then, let's get started on crafting that fishing rod, yes, yes. To begin, just select the protected. Just select the project from the workbench and get started. Go ahead and give it a try. Alright, yeet. Craftable, alright. Let's craft a flimsy fishing rod. Craft a flimsy fishing rod. Let's do it. Oh, damn. Oh my god. Hey, I made a flimsy fishing rod! Yes, that was perfect. As you can see, crafting is quite simple, provided you have the correct recipes, hmm? And that concludes my free DIY workshop. Oh, there's just one last thing. I have a few common DIY recipes for you, free of charge, naturally. I just need to send them to you. To your Would you mind opening it up? <laughs> Bro, we just come. We're just over here texting the recipes to each other. Oh, wait, now we actually have DIY recipes, a whole other app. Splendid, thank you. The DIY app is now installed on your phone and ready for you to use any time. And it's only those like that. And the flimsy fishing rod you just crafted is yours to keep. It may not last forever. But it should serve you for a little while at least. Speaking of fishing, I'm no master angler, but perhaps I can give you a few tips. Hmm? In my experience, you should aim to find the shadow of fish when you cast your line, yes, yes. Well, I, Tom, I kind of played the last two games in the series, so I, I'm, I'm pretty good at fishing. Do anything for now. That is a recycle box for all the island residents to use. We'll be using it for items removed during construction and such. Yes, yes, if you see anything that you like, feel free to take it. Right, right. If the box gets full, we'll get rid of the oldest items first, so don't delay in picking out what you want. Uh, oh, cardboard box, a tree branch. I would like to die. And what's this? Oh, I should give you a brief introduction to that terminal as well. That is our next stop. It's a terminal for services that will further enhance your island life. At the moment, you can use two services, Marcelino. The first is Nick Shopping. It's a catalog shopping service for items that can be hard to find on an island. Second, this terminal service has an automatic bell dispenser, or ABD, for the makeup. Nook. We're also looking at a service by which you'll be able to redeem Nook Miles for various things. Placing advantage of these wonderful services, quite beneficial indeed, yes, yes. Welcome! Welcome to Nook. Stop. A multimedia terminal for nooking. Once per day, accessing the Nook Stop will award you a bonus daily miles. Day 1, 50 bonus miles. Oh, so every time we come here, we get a bonus for this? Please select from the following services. Um... Let's go... Let's see what Nook Shopping is like. Oh, we can buy... Oh, we can buy a Nintendo Switch?! Oh, but that it looks expensive. Ho, ho, brother, ho! So DIY recipes, let's see. DIY recipes, check this app for info on the DIY recipes you've collected. You can also register frequently crafted items as favorites, so make good use of it while you DIY. All right, so how do I DIY my, um, her gift, leaf umbrella? Learn, that's how we do it, huh? Okay, sweet. I learned a DIY recipe for a leaf umbrella. Really? That's all I had to do? Just look at it? So guys, um, just a little quick announcement right now. Uh, I wanted to say, um, if 
you guys are liking, you know, if you guys like these like little slow type of videos, you know, they're not really fast paced and they're kind of different from the usual type of videos we do, you know, like uh, Mario games and like all of the excitement. Um, Animal Crossing definitely is one of those kind of like slow games and you just kind of like take your time to do, you know, like all the stuff that you want to do is it takes time basically is what I'm saying. Like I've been recording here for 30 minutes. Um, just kind of looking around and like finding stuff and reading, but that's Animal Crossing. And so if you guys just want to see more of these kinds of videos, you know, leave a like, subscribe, and don't forget to tap the bell when you do that. I made a leaf umbrella, right? So we can't keep crafting. So I guess we're all done for now. So what I want to say is that if you guys like enjoy these kinds of Animal Crossing videos, you know, I'm not really talking that much. Um, it's mostly me trying to figure out how to play. If you guys want, you guys can leave comments down below. You guys can always leave comments uh, telling me what I should do next or what I'm doing wrong. And just give me advice, you know, if you really want to, like, you know, help me out in this um, island life. If you guys have the game, um, I could probably friend you guys. If you guys want to play together, I could check out your islands um, and all that kind of cool stuff, you know? So if you guys <laughs> really like this series, Want to see more episodes and uh, tap the like button. That's just click the like button if you're like, you know, on a computer. <laughs> Man, I love this process of just making stuff. I made a flimsy net. Keep. Oh wait, nope. I don't want to keep crafting my bed. That was a mistake. All right. See you guys. So we can always just come back to the recycle box. See if there's any um, tree branches for us to pick up. Hey, look at this fire. Fire! Did anyone put anything new in here? Nope. Alright. So, can we check out other people's homes? Looks like no one's here. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can't check out their homes if they're not, you know, inside their house. So, huh. I guess we should probably go fishing then, huh? Alright, let's go fishing. Uh, home. Yeah! Oh my gosh, this brings me back. All right, let's check out how many fishes we need in order to get the nook miles that we want. Angling for perfection. All right, we need 10 for today, guys. So let's try getting 10 for this episode. This might take a while, but I may, I'm, I'll probably make jump cuts for each time I get a fish. So you guys don't have to sit and for like an hour. Oh, yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. I forgot to do it. Okay, okay. <laughs> yes, that was a pretty small fish. I caught a bluegill. Do you think it's do you think it calls me pink lung? Oh, come on! Yeah. Man, that's a small fish! Yes! I caught a pale chub. That name seems a bit judgy. Pretty small fish. But, you know, don't judge a fish by its size. And that was a whole tadpole! <laughs> Zebra turkey fish. Land. Air. Water. Make up your mind. Why are you bullying me? And I know you want me. I know I want you. You know you want, want me! me! Yes! Alright, yes, we caught a tilapia. We got tilapia, man. It makes me happier. Bam! That's right, that's right up your alley. That's right up your alley. Just turn around. Turn around. Every now and then I get a little bit chum. I get a little chum. His name is Pale. Oh! Oh! I almost missed it! I almost missed it! Yes! Oh my gosh, I almost messed that up. Yes, I caught a black bass. The most metal of all fish. Get my finger off the A button! Alright, there we go. It always surprises me whenever they start <laughs> chomping on it. Like, Pr Prussian carp? My skills are sharp. Here we go. Here we go. Bam! All right, I caught a black bass. All right, so that's 10. Oh. oh no, it's the end of the line for my trusty flimsy fishing rod. Did it really just break? I guess it did. All right, so let's check the nook miles. Bam, and let's collect our reward. 300 miles. All right, we got some titles too. All right. Oh, we got more nook miles? What did we get rewarded? Trash tools. Oh. Using it until, until it breaks. Dang, that's really a reward. 20? 
We need to break 20 more for the next one? Oh my goodness. Right, I found a creature. Oh, splendid. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh, which one should I give him? I don't want to give you tilapia, because that's way... Uh, let's give him... It's a zebra turkey fish. Hello. Oh, what a catch! I do believe this is a zebra turkey fish. This island can support a zebra turkey fish. Why, who knows what other fantastic creatures we might find living here? Marcelino, I have an idea. A new friend of mine runs a museum, and I'd love to send it to him for a closer look. Would you be okay with that? Uh, I kind of. I know where this friend is. I know what this friend is. I know who it is. All right, cool. Thank you. I promise I'll take a good extra, extra good care of your zebra turkey fish. Oh, that reminds me. This is, this is in no way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a useful app to show you. Is it for selling fish? Oh, bro, my joy cons is like. Oh, crit Critterpedia. I sent you to Critterpedia. It's a terrific resource for an inspiring, aspiring island researcher just as yourself. Such as yourself. With this one app, you'll get all the important details about the bugs and fish you catch. Yes, yes. I do hope you'll continue to fill it up with your discoveries and share them with me today. Well, share them with me too. I'm sure I'll be able to come up with some kind of additional reward, hmm? Alright, so, <clears throat> let's go, let's, let's tell them about that stuff. Right, I'll probably make a jump cut to this too, guys. So, I will meet you guys after I'm done showing you all the new fish I've caught. Ah! Guys, you won't believe what's happened so far. Um, I'll probably explain a lot of it more on the next episode. But oh my gosh, what would you like to talk to me about? All right, so um, right now, guys, basically what's happened? I've given so much fish to this to Tom. Um, Blather is the the, the owl from the last time we crossed the games at ran, ran the museum. Um, well, he's basically coming to this island, and I have to pick a spot for him. So, <sighs> dang. Uh, <laughs> What should I do about my moving fees? Oh, I can't give him no, I can't give him no more fish. Oh, because Blathers is coming. Yes. I have to give it to him. I have to give it to him. So, from now on, I don't have to give Tom Nook the fish, but I have to give the fish to Blathers. So, let's go find him a good spot. Blathers can set up his place now. Right, so this, this is gonna be Blathers' new home, I guess. All right. So now let's look at the criteria, the Critterpedia. I mean, sorry, Wikipedia, Critterpedia. So check this app for information on the bugs and fish you've caught. Um, I could probably do this on my own time if you guys really want to know. You guys, I mean, you guys could just find out on your own time as well. Um, like I'm gonna do in a bit. So dang. All right. So this is all the new stuff we just caught. That's the crit that's the Critterpedia basically. And Nook Miles, let's see. Um oh okay, have a nice DIY. Yeah. Yeah. And that's all of them for Nook Miles. Yep. Alright, so DIY recipes. Let's check out. So he basically get dang, we can make Alright, so we can make this type of campfire. We can make a bonfire. We can make tiki torch. We can make log steaks. Okay, so the very, what I'm most excited about is that flimsy axe and the flimsy watering can. We He also, because Tom Nook gave us some flowers, right, to plant. So now with the watering can, we can actually make those plants grow a lot better. So let we can do that now, and we can also use the, get a flimsy axe. We need stone, huh? All right. So we, a lot, a lot has happened. So let's take our inventory. Yeah, we got he gave us five red lily bags. Dang. Uh, let's check out. I never seen my leaky bell yet. Dang. <laughs> let's go. It looks so cool. All right. Uh, let's uh, put it away now. And I still don't have a wall to put this in. Red lily bags. Black bass. Bluegill. And I don't think I can trade with Tom for now. So what I want to find right now. I guess I'll maybe find stone. Oh, what's that? That's a balloon. With the present. That's that's from like. Oh, okay, so here's the stone. I got the stone. 
I knew, I knew it'd be there. Bro, we can't get that yet. We don't have a slingshot. I know we need a slingshot to open those from the last game, from the prior games. Oh, there you are. All right. Shoddy. Oh, didn't I just see you over there, Cheeky? You don't have a twin, do you? Let's talk. I kind of moved here on a whim, and I'm not sure I brought enough bells with me, Cheeky. Like, you hear a deserted island, and you think you're not even going to need money, yeah? I need a plan. Hmm. I heard I can get bells selling fruits and weeds and stuff to Timmy. If I do that, maybe I'll be alright. Oh, we can sell stuff to Timmy. Oh, that's a rock. Alright, rock to start like that. Good. So, we can sell stuff to Timmy. Alright, this is Tommy. This is Tommy, right? You're Tommy. Yep, you're Tommy. So we can sell stuff to Timmy. You probably already know that wood comes from trees, right? But we get stones and other min mineral materials from rock. You can shape trees, but if you have an axe, you can chip off pieces of wood too. You can whack rocks with a hard object like like an axe to break off their materials. All right, and we can we can craft an axe if we find sticks. Okay, we have. There's a lot of stuff we can do. At the moment, it's kind of overwhelming. So we need a plan. We need a plan for what we're gonna do. And I'm probably gonna make up a plan for what we're gonna do for the next episode since I'm kind of out of time, guys. So next episodes, I'm next episode, I'm most likely gonna do. Let's see, I can I should probably make an axe next episode. Yeah, so that's a pretty good place to stop, and I think that's where I'm gonna end it off. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe. Tap just click the notification bell to be notified of every video we make. So in any case, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.